Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Yo, 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 yo! Is it recording? I don't know. Yeah, it's recording. Hey guys, uh, we got Taffy in the video with us today. <laughs> really, there's nothing better. If you're new here, my name is Maddie. This is my fiance, Kaden, and hey my guys. dog, Taffy. She just wanted to join, and I couldn't say no because she's rolling in. Very <laughs> cute, though. So, today we wanted to show you guys five ways to style a gray pair of sweatpants for guys and girls because I know a large majority of my YouTube audience is girls. So, if you're a girl, I'm genuinely curious do you shop for your boyfriend or your husband? Like, are you in charge well, of that? Well, that's a good question. Because we were talking about that the other day, and like, he shops for himself. He's super into style, super into fashion. But I know, like, for my sister and for a lot of girls out there, they just like buy clothes for their husband or their boyfriend. So, if you are one of those girls, you will love this video because you'll get some guy outfit inspiration. Or if you're a guy, you'll also get inspiration. Or if you're a girl. So, yeah. yeah. Anyway. And honestly, who doesn't love sweatpants? So, let's like try and figure out ways to wear them always. Yeah, with the current situation, with the quarantine, and us being at home, I've literally worn sweats every single day for, I want to say three weeks. Actually, but <laughs> that's a lie. Yeah. We've been wearing sweatpants since winter started. Yeah. <laughs> every day. I think it's basically as soon as like sweatpants like came into style and it's like been okay to wear sweatpants, I don't really, I haven't worn jeans. Yeah, because we both work from home and so we just like don't have to get dressed up really if we don't want to. So sweatpants have been the way to go. So But also it's a vibe. It is it's a vibe. It's like such a I'm look so and happy. I love it. Yeah, I'm so happy that sweatpants are in style because they are just amazing, so comfy. Yeah, they're and they're so more chic. versatile than you think too. Yeah. So we're going to show you guys five ways to style them. They're all going to be like edgy, street style kind of looks. And they're super cozy looks. And we're also going to show you um, a way or two to like dress them up and make them fancier. So also for our outfits, we like corresponded them. So they're kind of They're matchy, basically the matchy. same. Yeah. They're, they're, both, they're both the same vibe. So like they're both going to have the same aesthetics, I guess. Yeah. So for my first outfit, I wanted to do like the very basic matching sweatsuit with the matching sweatshirt and sweatpants. And the sweatpants I'm going to be wearing in all these outfits are from Boohoo. They're the mix and match oversized sweatpants. They are amazing. They're literally only $11 and they fit like a dream. They're so comfy. They come in a bunch of colors. The quality is actually super impressive for yeah, the price point. It is. Yeah. They might be sold out right now because they sell out all the time, but they always restock them. So I'll link them and and then I'll also link some other sweatpants that I really like from their site and from other sites down below if you guys like need a pair. But they're amazing, so keep an eye out for a restock if they're sold out. But the sweatshirt that I got, I got in a size large, and I just like to tuck it into my bra for like a cropped kind of look. On um, Boohoo's website, they have the sweatpants, and they also have a sweatshirt and a crew neck that goes along with the sweatpants, like the perfect color match. So I have both. I have the sweatshirt and the crew neck, and the crew neck I just cropped just to make it like a cropped sweatshirt. So you can pair either of those with this, and honestly, any sweatshirt. The and idea then, is to have the matching sweatsuit. Yeah, just yeah. any color matching that's grays matching. Or blacks. Yeah, and then I pair this with my Air Force Ones. They're one of my favorite sneakers ever, especially to wear with sweatpants. I think that they just look so good. So I have those on and then I also have a white hat that I just ordered from Kohl's, but it's a Nike hat and I think that it looks Shout really Shout out cute. Kohl's. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, so this is just a very comfy, casual, lounge around outfit, but it's also very in style right now and very, very cute. So I never feel like I'm just like bumming it out when I'm wearing this, even though I am because it's just still really cute. But you're not. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. For my outfit, I used the uh, Essential Fear God sweatpants. He's can, bougier than you me. You can get them at PacSun, Essence. They're, I think they still have them in stock on Essence. They're hard to find, but I do recommend if you're looking for a lower price point, um, you go for the minimal LA sweatpants. Yeah. They also have a really good everyday sweatpant. It fits super well, just like the Fear of God ones. So that's always a good option. And I paired it with the Essentials hoodie just so I could get the matching um, color. But again, there's other options if you want to go cheaper. Um, I really like to put a um, like vintage washed uh, black tee underneath and let it kind of hang out so that you just like kind of break up the sweatsuit a little bit, add another dimension to it. 
And of course, throw on those chains, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I added gold jewelry to mine too, whatever got to that. Yeah, and then lastly, I always go with a pair of high, high white socks and a pair of Air Force Ones or maybe a pair of like uh, Yeezy 350s or something like that. I like the white look. I like the socks at the bottom. I think it kind of adds another vibe. Um, you can also go uh, like sockless and scrunch them up a little bit so you show a little bit of the ankle. You know, the ankle. But uh, yeah, I think it's a really good looking fit. I think it's really easy and it's really easy to get away with like, oh, this dude's got good style you just put on sweats. Yeah. For the next outfit, this one is probably one of my favorites, especially because of these flannels I just found. The flannel I paired this this outfit with is from Boohoo Man, and honestly, it's insane. They're like a vintage brush look, and I, I love it. So we did this with a t white t-shirt underneath, some chains, and again, my Fear God Essential sweatpants. You can go with the minimal. Boohoo also makes a great sweatpant. PacSun also makes just a regular everyday sweatpant. We'll have really all of nice. them linked below. We'll link them below. And again, for convenience, I just did the Air Force One because you can never go wrong with the Air Force One. Air Force Ones are honestly like such an essential shoe, yeah. at least for me. Like I wear them with dresses. I wear them with jeans. I wear them with sweatpants. I wear them with shorts. Like I wear them all the time. The thing I love about them is they're classic. They're timeless. They look amazing. They're ridiculously comfortable. And they're only $90. So you don't have to be like worried, super worried about like messing them up or whatever. You can just wear them freely. And then when they're trash, you just get a new pair. Yeah. And then for my outfit, I did the same thing. I put on a white crop top and paired it with the sweats and then I had a plaid shirt. This plaid shirt in particular I got from Hollister, <laughs> which is super random, but Hollister. it's really cute. I got in a size XL for an oversized fit. I'll also link some plaid shirts from like Boohoo and stuff. Just other ones that I have and I really like down below too, but I paired it with that and then... Did anybody else shop at Hollister when they're in high school? If you did, let us know in the comments. Yeah. Because that was like Hollister the place. Was the thing. That yeah. was the place. And then for this one, I switched up the shoes and put on my white platform high top Ooh. Converse. I actually Talk customized these. Yeah. Yeah. So they have like the white Converse that kind of has the black or blue stripe at the bottom, but I customized them to make them all white all the way around. And then they're also leather instead of the canvas. Actually, technically, I customized yeah, them. He they did were it. a gift. But yeah. anyway. <laughs> but I did the leather all the way around because it's just like way easier to keep clean that way with white shoes. It's and a little so, bit more luxury look too. Yeah, they're really cute. I'll link the exact customization down below if you guys want to get the same one so you don't have to like go through the whole thing and make them. I'll just put the link to the ones that are already made down below. But those are my like second favorite sneakers to wear with sweatpants. I think that they're just really cute. I love the high top look, like how he wears the socks under the sweats. It kind of gives the same look like the white that just goes up into the ankle or up into the sweatpant doesn't show any ankle mm -hmm. I think it's just like a really cute look totally. so for the next outfit I wanted to do a little bit of a fancier thing because although sweatpants are dress perfect yeah although they're perfect to wear around the house and lounging you can also dress them up and wear them to like a dinner or an event or which something is like the that. thing because that was never okay like yeah. a year ago yeah and now it's in and I'm like dude I'm burning on my jeans. Yeah. Why would I put them on? Literally. They're I don't, so comfy. Yeah, they're the best. So I paired them with a white high neck crop top. It's just like a little bit more of a classy crop top, you know? It's just like Cla adds is that a, little a thing? Bit. Classy crop yeah, top. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> I think the high neck is just like a really classy look. Totally. And then I threw on an oversized blazer. I got this one from Zara, I believe. It's like an XL as well. Um, and I love the oversized blazer. And then I put on some black strappy heels. And it just, it looks so good. And like throwing your hair into like a sleek ponytail or a sleek bun and like putting on some big chunky gold jewelry. It's just, mm. it's a look. You Such guys. a vibe. It would also be really cute with white pumps if you guys have those too. But either way, I don't it's know just what that is, but still a vibe. The pointy closed toed heels. Oh. Fire. Yeah, yeah, those are pumped. Bye. But, yeah, so this is like a super easy, simple way to just dress it up and still be very comfy while going out and looking chic as heck. As heck. Yeah. For me, for the fancy look, I think it's a little bit different because you can't really go as fancy, I don't think, as like a pair of heels. Yeah. But what you can do, like what I did, is I did, um, obviously, the, the gray sweatpants. I paired them with a pair of Doc Martens to dress them up a little bit. Vintage t-shirt underneath, chains, watch ring, all that kind of stuff to up it a little bit, and then a long tan overcoat. Ooh. Color popped. Give it a, a vibe. Yeah, just so that, you know, it's it's still, again, it's not just that I'm sitting around in sweatpants. It's like, yeah. I got a look going. No, that's a look. And you can do one of two ways. You can let the, um, the sweatpant with the jogger just kind of rest on top of the dock. 
and kind of show off the dock. Or you can pull it down and go a little bit over. Or I guess you could go a third way, white socks, and pull them up a little bit more. So again, versatile, good look. And honestly, I think I'm going to wear it for the rest of the day. I like that look. Because it's a vibe. Yeah, that's really yeah. cute. Okay, for this next look, I wanted to pair my sweats with a white long sleeve crop top. And this is like a little bit of a fancier crop top because it's one shoulder and it has a tie. It's really, really cute. And it's just more of a simple look because it's just like the top and the sweats. And then I wanted to wear my Air Force Ones, but I wanted to copy his idea and put on some high socks. So these are Nike socks. They're actually from the boys section of Kohl's. Come on. <laughs> we love Let's Kohl's. go. Shout um, out Kohl's. Not sponsored. Yeah. But Could be if you wanted to. <laughs> Eat coals. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I think that like the high socks with the Nike logo popping out is just very in right now. Hi. Pair it with the fancy crop top. It's just a very cute, simple, cozy look. And then of course with the gold jewelry because you can't go wrong. You know what I mean? I'm actually going to put a vibe counter down in the corner because the amount of times I said vibe <laughs> just going to count. I think I've said it like 15 times wrongly on outfit three. <laughs> We're on four. Four. Yeah. <laughs> so for me, I actually went with uh, the sweatpants. You're surprised. <laughs> um, and I paired it with a um, long sleeve graphic tee because I think it's just, again, it has a nice vintage wash. Um, again, it's a simple outfit. Um, I also put on a Fear of God New Era hat. You can wear any New Era hat. Um, with the Air Force Ones because it's all I brought. But <laughs> I would normally pair that probably um, no socks with a pair of uh, Yeezys um, or lower like Air Max 97s or something like that where you can kind of show your ankle a little bit just for a little bit more casual, um, relaxed look. Honestly, I wore this the other day to go get my hair cut and I had like five guys compliment my outfit. And I was like, dude, it's a t-shirt and sweatpants. So like, it, it's just again, so easy, such a good look, really comfy. So for the last outfit, this is probably my favorite I one. I was just gonna say that. I think this is my favorite yeah, one Yeah, this is the one that I wear the most. It's the sweatpants, shocker, and <laughs> a crop top. If you with... didn't know, this is a sweatpants video. Yeah. And a crop top, like a tight one with a cropped baggy leather jacket and some dad sneakers oh, and yeah. a hat. So this leather jacket, I think it's under $100. I got it from Revolve. I wear it all the time. It's the perfect cropped length, the perfect amount of bagginess. It's just like really, really cute and in style right yeah. now. And the dad shoes I actually got from Boohoo. I think they're only like $20. It depends when you get it because they're always on sale for like 50 or 60% yeah, off, you Boohoo's know? Yeah, Boohoo sales are always great. Yeah, so they're around $20. They're actually very, very comfortable. Yeah, I was surprised. Saying, yeah. They're like super squishy and like they just feel really nice on your feet. And they look just like the perfect dad shoe. They kind of look like the Nike ones, I think. Yeah, they kind of look but, like the, um, I'll put a picture right here after I was Okay, told. yeah, but they're like very affordable. And then I just paired it with that same. Nike hat and this is kind of like a very 90s look and with the dad shoes and the hat and I just love it I think it's so cute the leather jacket dresses the sweats up just enough to where you like feel stylish you know it's yeah. not like a super cozy That's look exactly what I was gonna say. yeah but it still is very very comfortable this is like I wear this outfit at least like once a week so probably yeah so for me, it's obviously the same thing. I did the essential sweatpants, a white t-shirt. This one's kind of like an off-white t-shirt. Um, not the brand, it's just like the color. And um, again, I paired it with a leather jacket. But I, this is my favorite outfit because it's just like, at the core of it, it's just a t-shirt and sweatpants. But then you throw the leather jacket on it and it just takes it to another level. Uh, you can pair it with the docks if you want, but you, I'm gonna do it with just the Air Force Ones. Um, but I also really like doing this one with a pair of like AJ1 shadows. I'll put a picture right here if you don't know what that is. Or a pair of like just any um, Jordan just looks so good with this outfit. Um, you can add a hat, but uh, I, I like it a lot. And I wore it to church the other day. And if you can wear sweatpants to church, you're winning. So. <laughs> and by the other day, he means a couple weeks ago. Yeah, because we've been quarantine. stuck in the house yeah. forever. Yeah. So that is our ways to style sweatpants. Honestly, I could think of so many more ways. Yeah. And this was just for gray sweatpants. Like throw in tan sweatpants. Game or over. Black, black sweatpants. sweatpants is done deal. If like, you guys want to see those kinds of videos, let us know because we like this is very fun for us yeah. to be able to do this so 
Everything that we mentioned and talked about will be linked below. If you guys want to shop any of the pieces, feel free to do so. And if you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe and turn on the bell. And yeah. I think that we can get this video to a thousand likes. Yeah, I think so too. And so if you think that, all you have to do is hit the like button. It's really easy. It's really quick. Okay. And it helps us out a lot. Have the coziest, cutest sweatpant outfit week. Yeah. Yeah. Tag us in your outfits if you wear any of these. Oh, too. yeah. I want to see. Tag us on Instagram, on the stories. I love when people do that. I could see what you guys are wearing, how you style them, and it's really fun. So, tag us in your photos, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Love you guys.